when the documentary dropped. With a limited budget, we didn't have the resources to launch a full-fledged promotional campaign for the release of our Battle of the Beatmakers documentary DVD. So we piggybacked and released the DVD at the battle and had it playing on a video screen on the side of the stage. So either it was during an intermission or during a down period where producers might be playing some whack beats, the video would keep the crowd entertained. This was always an issue for beat battles of our caliber. With 32 producers in a battle, it usually makes for a rather long night. So unless the beats are banging all the way through, you need something to keep them interested enough to stick around until the end of a battle. On several occasions, once a producer is eliminated from the battle, he and all his supporters vacate the premises. I say he because up until that point, there were no female producers entering beat battles in Toronto. The first female producer to ever participate in BBM went by the name of NJ, which many people mistakenly called Enjoy. She now goes by a sheet of God. In any case, the documentary was generally well received, but we did receive our fair share of critiques as well. One of the first critiques I heard was, is this a documentary on Boy Wonder? I heard this mostly coming from industry types who felt the video was basically just about Boy Wonder. I didn't see it that way. If that was the perception, it wasn't done intentionally. But he was, without a doubt, the producer with the biggest street buzz and the most sought-after producer to come up out of Battle of the Beatmakers. That fact was undeniable and would prove itself true tenfold over the years, so I had to just accept the criticism and let it play itself out. Other people felt like the documentary was a little too draggy. In hindsight, I think the documentary served its purpose to document a part of history that I felt was important in the legacy of Toronto hip-hop and also so nobody could later come along and distort the real story. <laughs> 